Olympic champion in ice dancing Natalia Bestemunova believes that it is not interesting to watch international competitions without Russian figure skaters. As for women's singles and pair skating, we are now several goals higher than the whole world. After our competitions, watching international events in these events is not so interesting, there is nothing to be surprised about. If we talk about men's skating and dancing, then we have something to strive for. Tass quotes Bestemunova. Perhaps some fans remember a bright couple from Hungary at the recent European Championship in Finland. Maria Ignatieva and Anil Semko are a good example of sports outside of politics, because in the current realities, it is really unusual to see a duet of a Russian woman and a Ukrainian, even if they represent a third country. At the European Championship 2023, Ignatieva Semko took a high 10th place and were preparing to break a personal record at the World Championship. However, just a week before the start, Semko ended up in the hospital. And not because of an injury received in training, but with a knife wound after a walk around Moscow. What happened to the skater and what are his plans? Figure skater Daniel Semko ended up in a Moscow hospital with a stab wound. Doctors at the Botkin Hospital diagnosed the skater with a stab wound in his right thigh. But how could an athlete have such an atypical injury? Situation with many dark spots. Daniel first told the doctors that he ran into an unknown man near Petrovsky Park in Moscow, after which he felt pain in his thigh and discovered a wound. At the same time, the attacker disappeared, and the skater could not remember his signs. However, after the doctors called the police, the athlete began to tell law enforcement agencies a different version of what had happened. Semko told the police that he had scratched himself badly, accidentally clinging to someone's bag, and had no complaints against anyone, so he did not want to write a statement about the attack. Unfortunately, even a day later there is no official confirmation or details of the incident. The fate of Daniel is unknown to his former partners, representatives of the Hungarian Figure Skating Federation, the current coaches of the Ignatiev Semko pair Irina Zsak and Alexander Svinin, refused to discuss Semko. Therefore, it is difficult to say what really happened. One thing is certain. Daniel was in Moscow with his partner Maria Ignatieva and was preparing with the Zsak Svinin team for the World Championship, which starts on March 20 in Satama, Japan. In his free time, Semko trains children. In Petrovsky Park, he was probably just returning from a rolling. The only thing that is now clear for sure is that if the information about the injury is true, then there can be no talk of any World Cup. Which is a shame, because the couple showed confident results during the season and progressed. At the European Championships in January, the guys got into the top 10 and won the second quota for Hungary for the next year in ice dancing. The only quota for the World Championship seems to be lost, there is no other duet with a technical minimum in this team now. What is interesting? Semko is a native of Odessa and began his sports career in the Ukrainian national team. When he skated in Kyiv, he had two partners. First, Yana Berdidim, with whom he spent his childhood career. He entered the international level with Vera Gorodetskaya, but two seasons later the duo broke up. After that, Daniel decided to change his citizenship and went to Budapest. In Hungary, he was first offered a local girl, Vila Martin. However, even with her, under the guidance of the Hungarian specialist Nora Hoffman, Semko did not win success. Then he went to Moscow, where in the Jacques Svinin team they were just looking for a partner for Maria Ignatieva from Yekaterinburg. She first performed with Alexander Lexinian, and then spent two seasons with Mikhail Bragin, and even participated in the Adal National Championship. However, no one saw prospects, and a strong partner was left out of work. Ignatieva changed her citizenship to Hungarian, and became a two-time champion of this country together with Semko. The coaching staff also included Hoffman, and the preparation for the competition took place both in Budapest and in Moscow. Now the media writes that Semko is allegedly not going to live in Russia anymore. But whether this is true or not, one can only guess.